Tom Giacomartini. I work for the delegation. Okay, um, let me introduce everybody yeah. to you formally. This is Margaret Van. She's the CFO. You know Rolando yeah, Blackman. Yeah, yeah. He's yeah. one of the managing directors. And Jace is the yeah. other managing director. He, we were in Cote d'Ivoire. Yeah, okay. um, uh, this is Martin. Everybody okay. will introduce himself. Okay. I'm on time. You yes. Me. yes. You don't know me. I'm Kone Yakuba from Washington. Nice to meet you. I'm Rosalie Yaka. Okay. Who are you? I'm Kone Mamadou. I'm Jean Pierre. Mr. Mr. Koulibaly? He went uh, yesterday in Cote d'Ivoire. Oh, that's right. He, to told, yeah. he told me he was going it to Cote d'Ivoire well. Yeah, it will be with the team on the, on, on the ground over there. Excellent. Yeah. Excellent. So, we have the time to, to make this success. Excellent. Perfect. Excellent. Okay, I, I, I just came to, uh, so that you could meet Margaret, first of all, yeah. and, um, you know, to discuss where we're going and, uh, how we're going to get there, yeah. and how we're going to approach things from this point forward. Yeah. You know, we yeah. want to uh, ratify the agreement that the minister extended to us so graciously. Okay. And uh, I wanted the whole team to be here. You know, it was just me and Jason Cote d'Ivoire, but uh, I wanted you to have the opportunity to, to uh, see and meet the whole team for yourself. So when they go back, uh, and I'm thinking about that. Um, you know, you were right when you said, uh, suggested that I go to Abidjan yeah. and to to meet and, and understand, uh, get a better understanding. You know, I'm in Los Angeles and uh, we're here in the United States and I really didn't uh, have a full appreciation of Cote d'Ivoire until I went to Abidjan. And uh, I really, really like Abidjan. I like Abidjan. I like uh, the opportunities that uh, we can take advantage of uh, as a team, you know, uh, working with the, the, the people there and uh, bringing resources there and for, for everyone's benefit, especially the uh, SMEs and, um, and, the, and the banking. I did for a while, your email to the minister himself. Oh, okay. He's very excited about the call to meet the other team. Okay. Yes, yes and uh, you know, I want to also uh, touch on the waste to energy as well. Yes. You know, as we told you, uh, waste to energy was uh, was not our company, but we represent, or we, we would be a broker, basically, in that transaction. and. Uh, that there's a great need in Cote d'Ivoire for that technology. And uh, we, we... And for electricity. Yesterday, at the May Day ceremony in Cote d'Ivoire, uh, the president himself opened up. And uh, we can have private energy company. Really? Yeah. Really? That wow. Fantastic. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so, that's excellent. Yeah. All kinds? Solar? Everything? All kinds. Mm -hmm. So have a cheaper electricity for the people. Yeah, I um, I visited a, 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 a section of Cote d'Ivoire where there was no electricity. We have to get electricity down to those people across the street from the beach. Yeah. You know, I um, I really want to do some housing and some some development to uh, make life better for those people down there. They, there's a lot a lot of people. I I don't even. I don't even know how many people there were down there, but they, they, they really, that really touched me. Right. Right. Abidjan has uh, 5 million and 500 inhabitants. A very, very large city. Yeah, and about 500,000 of them were down in that community down there. And I, uh, we really got to do something to address that whole situation, you know, build a bunch of housing. and. But I don't know how we would, uh, you know, support after we got them into the housing. I don't know what we do. Maybe through the SMEs, you know, create yeah. the jobs. <laughs> we are talking about that because the housing, the whole package of all the project in Cote d'Ivoire, the public, and the PPP, all the people that they are in French, but we can transfer for you. I have all that in my office, and we talk about that. 
the, or what about the projects that are in Paris that are on the agenda? I, I went to the website and uh, saw the projects uh, that uh, the, uh, the Minister for Planning and Development yeah. has on uh, the agenda. Was it Paris Yes. 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 Thousand. Yeah, twelve billion dollars. Twelve billion five hundred uh, yeah. dollars in <coughs> projects. If I remember, I'm just doing it for memory. Who does the project? Excellent. Well, it's good news about the energy company. Yeah. Excellent. Wow. That's yeah. excellent. That's excellent. Yeah. Thanks for the Perrier again. Yeah. I know I like that. <laughs> and the cashews. <laughs> I haven't had a chance to practice my French <laughs> since I left Abidjan. <laughs> a lot of people were speaking English there, right? Well, yeah, they were. And I was trying to speak French. Thank God they spoke a little English. <laughs> Well, uh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's the cashews. Yeah. With the cashews? Yeah. Yes. I ate a whole bunch of them when I was dying. Okay. Okay. You know, I want to say on, uh, on camera mm -hmm. how, um, uh, how oh, okay. gracious and welcoming everybody was to Jason and I in, in Abidjan, in Cote d'Ivoire. They really, really uh, treated us very, very well there. And I, I want to put that on record. That from the Minister of Waste and Energy to the Minister of Planning and Development, the Minister of Finance, they really uh, gave us their time and their, their attention. And they all had busy schedules. They were, they were coming from one meeting to, to meet with us, and they gave us the utmost courtesy and extended it to us, and it it, it it made us feel very very welcome, and 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 very motivated to uh, to uh, do business there. And you know, as I told them in the meeting, you know, we're we're not nice guys. You know, we're not doing it because we're nice guys. We're doing it because we're businessmen, and we see a real, real huge opportunity. For all of us in Cote d'Ivoire, and we want to, we want to share. We, you know, um, Africa, and the United States and other Western countries have a, a history of exploitation when it comes to Africa, and we, we don't, we don't share that philosophy. We want to, we want to develop and share. We want to, we, we're kind of like a people first situation. That's why we, we chose the SME development first, so that we can start the small businesses and uh, create the jobs, you know, in the cashew and uh, cocoa processing area. But, you know, beyond that, you know, we want to we wanna become part of the fabric there, the financial <coughs> fabric. And, you know, of course, get rich in the process. <laughs> <laughs> That's the main goal, right? Well, not the main goal, but a very important goal. This is a form of good addition. Thank you. That's Those good. are talk. Okay. Yeah. Um, my uh, impression of um, the Ivory Coast uh, before and after this meeting is a great opportunity for. Uh, for so many different uh, reasons, it's an opportunity to, uh, to expand business in the country, it's an opportunity to expand agriculture in the country, and it's, a, it's an opportunity to create jobs and uh, 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 increase the, the lifestyle and uh, the, uh, the, the standard of living in, uh, for the people in Abidjan. We, we, we focused on the people. Uh, and, and uh, the economy there. And I think it would be a tremendous opportunity to take advantage of. We are intending to travel to Abidjan next week, and um, hopefully after we meet with the people and talk to them, you know, uh, we could start probably, uh, I don't know, June, July, 
you know, we take the rest of the month to uh, to formulate and negotiate and, and do things. We we are already committed on paper to uh, begin our, our SME business within three months, and that was uh, three months from April. Okay, SME is more medium enterprise. Yes, yes, we we, we committed to. Uh, 50 million U.S. dollars every six months for the next two and a half years for small and medium enterprises, and we, we want to start that, um, as I said, maybe June or July. And how many people you intend to employ? Well, over the course of the 30 months, we, the target was 300,000 employees, 300,000 jobs. But you know, we that was the original target. We probably looking closer to 500,000. Over the course of how many? Uh, 30 months, over the course of two and a half years, yes. Who would have the equipe américaine, avec laquelle nous nous allons partir à l'usant le 10 mai, nous attendons d'arriver sur le terrain, d'avoir les propositions et les accords se concrétiser, afin de faire profiter de notre, de notre travail à la jeunesse moyenne.